can't mess this up. See, I'm just an ordinary girl nervous as anything about her first day at college. OK, so maybe my past is not so ordinary. But seriously, if anyone can ruin a perfect life, it's me. Can you really see yourself here? At the Athena, trying to make it as a fashion designer, you are aware of our reputation. Yeah, yeah, I, I can see myself here, but um, I have a really active imagination, so I can see myself in lots of places, like, like here or, or drowning. Yeah, the drowning image is pretty strong right now. Let me rephrase. You're a model. You're used to wearing the clothes, not creating them. Oh, I'm, I'm not a model. I'm an ex-model. So it's true. It ended your career. Can we change the subject? Um, here, look, I can show you my portfolio. Yeah, I didn't exactly nail the interview, but by some miracle, they still offer me a place. So I can't mess this up. Roast into a but it's not really all that. Sometimes you just need your friend. We're electric. They look really confident to you. Which is OK, because I'm confident too. Totally confident. Meet you. How's everything going? It's so weird being at castings without you. Isn't Lexi there? She's late. Again. Again. The other girls have better cheeks than me. Not possible. You have cheeks made for blusher. And I'm an expert. I see your cheeks every day. <laughs> oh, I miss you. I'll cook for us tonight. What do you want? Something I wouldn't normally have, like chocolate and chips oh, and cheese. So, food group starting with the letter CH. I'm on it. I've got to go. I've got art class to get to first period. That's so awesome, being paid to draw. Yeah, I'm not being paid. I'm paying them. Well, still cool, though. Yeah, yeah, I suppose it is. And listen, don't worry. You've got this. Foundation students. I expect a lot from you. I expect long hours and hard work. I expect dedication and passion. I expect to see your talents grow. But right now, I expect you to draw a house, a bird, a cloud, and a man. Why are we doing this exactly? And you are? I'm Nisha, short for Anushka. You can probably tell I'm descended from Prussian royalty. Well, Nisha, short for Anushka, we're doing this because I'm your tutor and I said so. Can I uh, photograph a house, a bird, a cloud and a man? I'm a photography specialism. So, so this is art class and it's a requirement. Next question. What's the point? You'll find out the point of the exercise when I want you to find out the point of the exercise. Right, no more questions. They've gotten boring. You have 15 minutes. Don't stress. Despite your lack of fine art experience, you can do this. Nyla Malik, stop making goggle eyes at Samuel and get to work. to the left, please. Her profile's a little ill-defined. OK, Miji, is it? Miju. You can go now, Miji. Thanks. Moving on to shared assignments. 
Now, every week you're going to get one, and it could be any discipline. So fashion design students will build sets, jewellery designers will paint landscapes. But this week, I want you all to design and make an outfit for someone else to wear to the Freshers' Ball tomorrow night. Pairings are on the board outside. Your outfits will be graded, and your marks do matter. I expect you to prove yourselves, starting today. Lexi Fitzgerald. OMG, Miju, you have got to see my new hat. I got it off this guy in Camden. On the market? No, 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 he was just walking to the tube. I offered him some advice. What was the advice? You should give me your hat. <laughs> Looks super cute on me, right? I'm going to wear it to the casting. How did yours go? I have an ill-defined profile. You always say stuff like that. It doesn't mean anything. <sighs> my mum wants to know how it went. Oh. Awesome sauce. <laughs> I don't think she's going to know what that means. <laughs> Lexi Fitzgerald. It means your awesome sauce. I'll see you at home later. Yeah. Paired with Lee Howells. I'm Lee. And you're Nyla, right? Everyone was saying you were some famous model, so I uh, Googled you. Oh, you didn't see, um... Uh... I'm going to need more words to answer that question. Don't worry. Doesn't matter. I'm not actually that famous. Loads of people don't care who I am. Nyla Malik, right? I wear skinny jeans because of you. Oh, um, thanks. I think... I'm specialising in fashion, too. We're going to be excellent friends. I'm descended from Prussian royalty. <laughs> See ya. So, for this assignment, you should know I hate pink and also flowers. Of course, you think I'm going to design you something flowery, as if I'm that kind of girl. <laughs> Nyla's flatmates say she loves filling their Shoreditch flat with flowers. Taken out of context. Really? No. But it's not my defining characteristic. Right. Also says here you like kittens. <laughs> yeah, but I mean, who doesn't like kittens? <laughs> you should get to know me. We should get to know each other for the assignment. I'll just read your latest interview. No doubt I'll find out something really enlightening, like your star sign. I don't even have your measurements. So, guess who I'm paired with? Where did you come from? Royalty? Were you not listening before? Anyway, I'm paired with Sam when you were checking out in art. Oh, I wasn't, um, I... I don't care. But what I care about is that his specialism is jewellery, so you won't understand tailoring. Also, He's a bit poor. Does that matter? Well, if you haven't grown up around class, how are you meant to understand it? Coco Chanel was from a poor house. Her mum did laundry and her dad was a street vendor. How do you know that? Because, despite public opinion, I can read. <laughs> but you can't sew. I, I, I can sew, it's just jammed. Don't worry. I've got this. I'm Nisha, descended from Prussian aristocracy. My friend, the former model, Nyla Malik, is struggling. Does anyone know how to fix these machines? Um, I do. I used to fix my mum's all the time. Um... <laughs> think this was the problem. This should work now. <laughs> You're a lifesaver. Sure, if you think that sewing machines are alive. Oh, I do, actually. His name's uh, John T. Your sewing machine's called John T. <laughs> yeah, he doesn't like it either, but hey, what can you do? <laughs> <laughs> oh, um... The other guy started it. Um, about before uh, what Ali said... No, it's um... cool. I'm not an idiot. I know you weren't checking me out. I should tell him I like him. But bravery isn't my strong point. Not since... <sighs> Poor me. Oh, oh. Don't look at me like that. Oh, I, I, I wasn't... Don't stress. You're bound to act weird. I mean, we have less than two days to design and make a whole outfit. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, it's pretty intense. And have you seen our timetable? I don't think we're going to be sleeping till graduation. That's if we get past foundation year. I read up on how many people make it through. 50%. That's all. I should never read up on anything. <laughs> Remaining naive is pretty tempting. <laughs> Especially for you. 
We all know who you are, Nyla Malik. We all know about your stupid mistake. <laughs> so, everyone knows. It's okay. I'm okay. I still don't want to hang out. Me neither. Um, I want coffee. Uh, flat, white, please. Skinny? Uh, normal milk is fine. Seriously? I drink normal milk on Mondays and Thursdays. <laughs> I've got so much to learn from you. That was sarcasm, right? 100%. I'll text you when I know. I love you, Mum. So, how'd it go? If it was up to me, I would have given the job to you. They offered it to you right there, even though you were late and wearing a fez. Maybe they wanted someone taller. The shoot for a blusher. Here, wear this. Fezzes make everything better. It's going okay-ish. I mean, my partner for the assignment doesn't want to talk to me. Kinda like Dad doesn't want to talk to you. Well, Dad'll come around, or he'll stay mad at me forever. Probably the second one. I'm not serious. He just thought <sighs> when the modelling was over, he'd come home. I couldn't. That would have been giving up. Nate still hasn't texted me back. Because you dumped him last week. You said he was boring. <laughs> He's so boring, I forgot I dumped him. <laughs> <laughs> so, who are you dating now? I want to say Mike. Weird. We're not expecting anyone. I figured you have a point. We probably should hang out if we're going to get this assignment right. Wow. That's really kicking against my preconceived notions of the shallowness of models. Don't judge. The blindfold makeup challenge is timeless. Mm-hmm. Do you miss your parents? Yeah. A lot. And my sister. Do you miss yours? No. Have you got a boyfriend? No. Have you ever had a boyfriend? No. Interesting. You're shyer than you look. <laughs> my photography. I like having an object between myself and people. All people? Yep. My fashion design. Before the modelling, we didn't have much money. So I used to make dresses for my sister. And when they were good, she felt good. And um, that made you feel good? Yeah. <laughs> Cute. But any longer, and this will turn into a face mask slash truth or dare situation. And that would be bad why? The fact I have to explain it to you is why. See you at college. Athena is intense, so I got an assistant. Why? This manicure has actual diamonds in it. It doesn't mix well with sewing. Halima! Come and meet Nyla. Well, Nyla Malik, um, I, I've got so many questions. Okay, I... Nyla has her own work. She doesn't have time to answer your questions right now. But you said that The I... deal was that if you sew for me, you got to meet her. You've met her. That's good. 
No need to thank me. Idea, right? It's a bad idea. I should probably think this through. It's different. Question is, do I like something so different? That's hard to say, because you're a figment of my imagination. The dress is like you. Confused, desperate, and begging to be liked. So don't embarrass yourself. Go for something simple and safe. I expect to find out if you can work under pressure. Each designer must come to the stage with their partner to be graded. We'll go alphabetically. Any questions? Good. And let's get started. Dude, you made me look like a girl. Can you live with it? Nyla Malik. I guess I'll have to. It lacks personality. Yours and Lee's. I'm grading you a D. I expected better. So I messed up. Again. I can't believe you were so stupid. You're my agent. You're supposed to be on my side. Oh, even when you call one of the world's top designers a sexist. He is. He didn't even treat me like a real person, just a thing, an object. Nyla, there are certain people in this world you can't speak out against. Even now? I thought that was the right thing to do. Some people think that, but I'm not one of them. See, I like money and to keep making it. So you need to learn to keep quiet and just take it. Let me read you some of the online comments. Nyla Malik tried to be smart and failed. She's doing it for attention. She's making it up. Nyla Malik will never work in this industry again. Millions of young girls dream of being models. You had that and you threw it away. I didn't. I just... Yes, you did. I've spoken to every label and designer I know. None of them will touch you. I'm dropping you from the agency. Your career is over. I keep messing things up. Ever since. There was this interview. The one where you called out Oscar Bierfeld. It ended my career. And I've been kidding myself, trying to think I could have another. Truth is, I'm not even good enough to be here. Seriously? Nyla! What? I can't believe you're making me do this. I'm not making you do anything. You don't even think I should be here, do you? I'm just another dumb girl that likes kittens. Uh, just come with me, OK? I need to show you something. See that interview? The one that ended your career? That's what made me show up last night. 
I was looking through all this stuff about kittens and blah, and then suddenly there's this honesty about not wanting to be an object. Maybe like you. So you're not allowed to quit, OK? Cut it out. It's good. I'm grading you a B. You could even consider changing your specialism. No. Uh, thanks. But seriously, no. Okay, so I just need to be cool and not do anything stupid. Hey. Are you uh, uh, sure you've got everything you need? Um, no, actually. Um, what if there's a zombie apocalypse? I couldn't survive with just this. I'd, I'd need a, a pen knife and at least some shoes I can run in. Yeah, well, on the plus side, this book on design and technique in three-dimensional textiles could definitely take out a zombie. <laughs> <laughs> um, I was actually looking for you. Oh, um, you were? Yeah, um, I made this. And I use the paperclip, that jam jam machine. It still technically belongs to you, so... I'll... So it would be totally rude of me not to wear it forever. Exactly. <laughs> Sam, you need to get set up. I'll see you later. About it, that would be good. Hey, look, my future boyfriend's the drummer in a band. <laughs> cool! <laughs> Thanks for the gas pass. College is awesome. <laughs> She's right. College is awesome. We think we're not original, that we don't have our own unique view of the world. But if I ask each of you to draw the same thing, a house, a bird, a cloud, a man, something happens. No two pictures look the same. Each of you brings your own way of seeing the world to the drawing. Like this one of Nyla's, where her man hugs the house as his hair turns into a cloud which the bird nests on. No one else sees these four things this way. This is your voice, Nyla. Listen to it. OK. So, I have a history, but I think it's going to be OK. I might not mess this up. Every college has its groups, but art college groups, there's something else. Over there. <laughs> Hashtag breakfast babes. Not if you want me to digest my food. Oh, how about with Sam and whoever that guy is? That guy's Lenny. I've seen him in halls. And if he starts playing that guitar, it's a hard no. And I'm out. Need some alone time anyway. Wait, but 
We've only been hanging out for like five minutes. I mean, it was basically just the queue. Nyla, for me, that's epic. So, I just need to figure out which group I belong to. Shouldn't be too hard. <laughs> is that you? It is indeed. But you look hideous. <laughs> In 20 years, you look back on what you're wearing now and feel the same shame of fashion oblivion. We thought we looked great because, for the time, we did. What you see here is a sign of the times I lived in. Now I want to know about your time. For this group task, you will make a 60-second film that tells me everything I need to know about being a teenager today. Have a clear message and don't be boring. Groups will be emailed later, so check your inboxes. I thought I was done with this stuff. What stuff? You didn't really go to high school, did you? No. I started modelling at 14, so... So you missed out on teenage cliques and all their catty glory. But this isn't high school. Meaning? Meaning this project could be the first step towards a potential friend group. Oh, Not ugh, more complicated yet happy like you read about in YA novels. My opinion of humanity is low. I'm between the ages of 13 and 19 even lower, so... No, it won't be that. Did you rock their world with your adorable face? I think maybe I did. They said my look was the look they were looking for. That is a lot of the word look. <laughs> I know. Maybe things are finally happening for me. But why haven't they called yet? A watched phone never rings. That's actual science. So, groups are in, and despite Lee's pessimism, I'm pretty sure mine has high friend group potential. This is how you see this scene playing out. Who are you? Sinjin, film director, pleased to meet you. And are all film directors called Sinjin? In your imagination, they are. Now, this scene's all wrong. You've imagined it rose-tinted, when in reality, it's like this. So, I've been trying to learn as much as I can about filmmaking. There are a lot of examples of how to storyboard in here. Were you really bored? It's called making an effort. Are you out of it? Yeah. I make an effort with my outfits every day. Unlike some people. I hate when people say some people, but they mean me. I hate that too. You can't agree with her. I heard her call your band derivative. I mean, only because they... are. Wow. Really clawed it back there. Why don't we talk about our ideas for the film? So I think being a teenager is about looking good in photographs and then posting those photographs online and then waiting for people to like them and say you look good. I've met puddles with more depth. I'd like to do something about family. Nope. The film should be a documentary. One that reflects what teenagers are actually like. Which is what, exactly? Self-absorbed. Unintelligent. Shallow. That's a very nuanced stance you're taking. It's an honest one. And I can prove it. Why don't we focus on something we all like? We have nothing in common. We do. We all like pizza. I'm gluten-free. More of a fried chicken girl. I think tomatoes were sent to kill us. I vote we split up, make our own films, then choose the one we like. But it's a group task. So, so we'll choose as a group. Need you? Still no phone call? No, but that's not why I'm tidying. I'm not stressed or anxious. I just think it's really important that we organise our spice rack. Okay. No, 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 no. Need you? We are young, reckless, magical beings. Kind of like unicorns, and unicorns don't tidy. OK. OK, I am a reckless unicorn. I'll stop. Just as soon as I've colour coordinated the dry pasta. I'm gonna make.
make a film And it's gonna be a really good film Even though I've never made a film before Lenny Right? Uh, right Are you making a film of yourself singing about making a film? <laughs> yeah My group ditched me when I said that I think being a teenager means being hungry a lot of the time. I don't need them, no. Because my mum says that I have everything I need inside me and I have a ton of followers online, so it'll definitely be okay. You're perfect. Yeah, I think so, but other people don't always agree. Unless you're making a film about solitude, you shouldn't be here. Oh, I'm just working on my storyboard. You seem to be missing a group. We're taking a break. From each other? You didn't exactly get off to a flying start, Nyla. If you want to prove you deserve your place, you need to do well this week. I know. But you'll only get a good grade if I can see that you work together as a group. In the same place, on the same film. Just the person. I want to up my likes on Athena chat. Which is my cutest? Oh, uh, they're all cute. Oh. OK, so, the film. Oh, mine's so great. I think it might be my best work. Wait, you finished already? Well, I already have, like, a trillion hours of footage of me, so I'll just edit that and add some filters. Well, do you need any help? I do have a question I need answering. Oh, go, shoot. Do you think Sam ignores me because I make him nervous? because a lot of guys get like that around me because I'm so hot. Yeah, probably is that. I just meant if you needed any help with the film. <laughs> no, I've got that covered. And that is the mystery of jeans. What do you think? I don't know how you come up with this stuff. So do you just want to follow me around all day? Uh, yep. Where you go, I go. A uh, day in the life of a pop star slash artist. I think calling me a star is a little bit much because I don't even have a band. But I do have the same birthday as Stormzy. Lee! Why black and white? Fits for solitude, I guess. Bit obvious, though. Shut up, imaginary film director. And anyway, why are you a posh white guy? Because even in your imagination, we basically control everything. Wow. I really need to work on that. True. You have ideas, even ones that extend beyond colour palettes. You should make a movie on your own. I guess if it's good enough, the others will pick it. Yes, and you can tell Ali you did it as a group. <laughs> She'll never know. I think Ali can actually smell lies. You're making excuses. Because I don't know what I'm doing. I don't think I've ever been an ordinary teenager. So, make it up. Sorry, it's just, did I mention I have a lot of followers online and they get kind of sad when I don't reply to their comments. And I get kind of sad when I have hair in my eye. They say the peacock is the vainest animal on earth. Hold. Oh. Lenny. OK, I get it. I have a lot of followers. But you've been messaging for an hour now. Do you miss me? I just think there cannot be a single other person in the world who needs to know what your favourite food is. You still don't get it, do you? Music is important. It helps people when they're feeling down. Yes. I can see how a song called The Mysteries of Cheese could be life-changing.
wow, this place looks amazing. No, it doesn't. This is not the home of reckless unicorns and I can't make Miju stop. Where is she now? <sighs> Asleep in the wardrobe. <laughs> if she doesn't get this job, I don't know what I'm going to do. Well, at least there's nothing left for her to clean. <laughs> There are 24 words that mean group in the English language. I know, because I looked them up. But today, I'm not going to care about any of them. More. Interesting, because no one else did. But... But... Tell me, I can take criticism. Well, like groups of friends, I get that, but the way you've shot them, being a teenager is just not that happy. No, but maybe it can be. Sometimes it feels like you might have been raised in a cult. In a good way. OK, yeah, I guess I kind of see what you guys mean. Yeah, they mean they're like angsty, depression, blah, yawn. That's not what I've done. It's the show us. That was so boring. And it was hardly about teenagers. Yes, it was. There was the brother looking after his younger sister. Sure. I liked it. But do you really see family that way? Well, not really. Didn't think so. And, dude, hardly on theme. All right, and yours isn't ready? It's nearly ready. I just have one more scene to edit. Yours it is, then. We can't agree on anything else. Do you think Lee likes comics? Or is she more of a graphic novel kind of girl? I'm guessing she's more into the political commentary, Persepolis style graphic novel kind of things. What do you think? Uh, I've got no idea. Like, she's not exactly the talky, I'm going to tell you about all my secrets type. What type is she? She is the please stop talking to me and stop asking about my secrets type. We should start a band. OK, are we just done talking about the whole Lee thing already? Oh, no. Good, because I still don't understand how she got you to be in her film. She asked. And she's... Smart, and she's passionate, and she's not one of those niche types who only care about clothes and makeup. Right, you know you are talking to someone who wants to make jewellery for a living, yeah? Yeah, and has a thing for an ex-fashion model. I don't. Like, I, I like Nyla. Like, I like everyone. Like, I've got a lot of life to give. <laughs> Whatever, man. I've seen the drool. Yeah, Ryan, you clearly like Lee, which is weird, because she's not exactly the friendly type. She's friendly to me. You still don't get it, do you? Music is important. It helps people when they're feeling down. They say the peacock is the meanest animal on earth. But behold, Lenny. Lenny. Oh, I did it. You hate musicians and people who like popular things because you're miserable and you think everyone else should be too. I was making a documentary. That makes me look like an idiot. It's OK. It's cool. You just wanted to make a good film. I hope you get an A. Didn't think I'd get it anyway. Didn't have my hopes up or anything, so I'm... Hello? Protection is character building, right? Yeah. <laughs> Who cares about a tidy flat? Not me. Who cares about a stupid 
Atlas Unicorn! <laughs> We can't use my film tomorrow. What? Why? Because I'm a horrible person. Cynical, not horrible. Well, one can feed the other. But I'm trying to change. We'll fail the assignment, but overall, decency wins. With you. I'm kind of busy right now. Turns out you give terrible advice. I should have stuck to my guns. And forced everyone to work together. Yes, rose tinted and everything, because working alone has turned out to be a total failure. But trying to make some perfect group where everyone fits neatly would have failed too. Okay, so we don't fit neatly, but we still fit. So shut up. I'm the director now. To be fair, you always were. <laughs> Sometimes you just need your friends We're electrically connected We're lighting our own way We got this all together No matter what they say We'll weather any storm And we'll ride it to the end Just stay connected What are you doing here? Hey, I've been looking for you guys everywhere. I need to see this. <laughs> Impressive. What if we just move to... Perfect. Yeah? You could... Well, yeah, no, yeah, 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 yeah. With a guy? Yeah, we could, um, yeah, if we went to... Um... Sorry. Um, you... You... Yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Finally! It takes it ages ago. I know. I needed to shower. But I'm here now and I smell like apples. Uh, congrats. Uh, but we need your opinion on uh, this section. Of course we do. <clears throat> right. So, definitely feeling better? Definitely. If I was working right now, I wouldn't be here eating ice cream with you. <laughs> <laughs> and you wouldn't have a piece of dried pasta in your hair? I knew I missed a bit. <laughs> Do you want me to get it, please? No, I don't care. Reckless unicorn, remember? <laughs> One day we'll have to be responsible and boring. And we'll care about house prices and what else do grown-ups care about? Oh, I don't know. Which politician said what to who and when? Right, we'll get so angry about that and we'll do things like removing pasta from our hair. <laughs> but that day is not today. <laughs> I'm nervous. But yesterday I couldn't even start with beans on toast, so progress. <laughs> yeah, you're right. Even if it isn't perfect, at least the film's real now. <laughs> For the record, I didn't think you were raised in a cult. I did once start my own religion. How old were you? Four. <laughs> and it mainly involved teddy bears taking over the world. I don't think that counts. <laughs> I once made up my own religion too. Oh, were you the queen of everything? No, I was the princess of everything. Because princesses are prettier. Guys, I'll uh, catch you up, OK? Dude, you can really paint. It's not working. See, this is what it's supposed to be. Can't make it work in this side. We're not showing my film. I thought you'd want to know. I 
wasn't trying to be cruel. Lucky you. It must come naturally then. I'm kind of in the middle of something here. I was wrong. I thought you were shallow and self-absorbed. That's a great apology. My school was full of people like that. So I, uh, had my walls up. I was wrong. You're not like those people. So, um, said walls are a tiny bit lowered. It's hard to say one thing about being a teenager because we're all kinds of things. We're hardworking and glamorous sometimes. We're happy and messy. Sometimes we're funny. I think being a teenager means being hungry a lot of the time. <laughs> And none of us are normal, not really. We're lonely. Or defensive. What was that gross thing you said? A complicated yet happy friend group that you read about? Yeah. Guess I can give it a try. We look out for each other and occasionally even drop the act. With the right people, we don't have to fit in. We can be ourselves. Or at least try to figure out who we're going to be. Denise, why are you... Wait, what? I'll call you back. That was my agent. Well, my ex-agent. She said I could make things right because a new label has asked me to model for them. Right, of course. It was a dream. <sighs> Pretty good dream, though. <laughs> Maybe if I wear the exact same outfit, today will pan out just like... Oh, wait. I don't own a Red Duck T-shirt. But whatever I decide to wear... Yes. Today has to be perfect. Look, it's just one shoot, and my agent... Well, technically, my ex-agent said it's my chance to put things right again. And what happens after this one shoot? Because I took a chance on you, Nyla, and as far as I'm concerned, you're either a student or a model. You can't be both. If I buy you a smoothie, please can you make the decision for me? <sighs> oh, as much as I do love pulverised fruit, no. <laughs> When's the shoot? Saturday. Just one day. Maybe I can do it and then decide. I mean, where even is Chippenham? The shoot's in Chippenham. Yeah? I could drive you. Why? Because you love the M25 at 6am? Yeah, it's one of the most beautiful sights in the world. <laughs> but also because Chippenham is where I'm from, and I promised my mum and sister that I would go and visit them this weekend. See? Perfect. <sighs> because anyone who's ever seen any film knows a road trip is where you fall in love. Breakfast jelly. Nyla made it for me. I need a good breakfast because I have big plans today. Today's the ballet for your mum's birthday. Mm-hmm. Which is why I am wearing these. Wow. Can you walk in them? Totes. 
I just need to concentrate. <laughs> See? There's no hill in this world that I can't conquer. <laughs> Lexi! Oh, oh, my ankle! No, no, not today. Are you okay? Oh, Sorry, oh, stupid oh, question. What can I do to help? I don't know, but I need to be okay. You're going to be okay. I'm going to take you to the doctor right now. <laughs> You hungry? What's your favorite sandwich? Not this one. Should we the road? Wait, um, I have an idea, one that will save the road trip. I didn't know I needed saving. Oh, I, I didn't mean, um... It's fine, I get it. I have been pretty quiet. I think going home just does that to me. Is it because of the other guy? What other guy? When you started college, you had a black eye and you said the other guy started it. Um, no, that's not the reason. So, what's this great road trip saving idea then? Oh, I made a playlist. And the stereo's broken. So there's a speaker on my phone. We can sing. I don't sing on principle. What principle? The principle of I don't want to look like an idiot. Well, how about I sing, and then once the fear of looking like an idiot passes, you join in. Deal. You just let me sing on my own for a whole hour. <laughs> I didn't warn you about my principles. <laughs> Text me when you're done. Bye. because you need to rest your ankle. I have never rested anything in my life ever, and if I was going to rest something, it wouldn't be today on my mum's birthday. I know. I'm just going to go to my room. On your own? Yeah, but I'm OK. I'm awesome sauce. <laughs> What are you doing out there? Yeah. That's it. And they're fighting? Since about eight this morning. It's like, let me lie in for once. I'm a teenager. <laughs> Come on, let's go. You not coming? I like being here. Do you want to go meet my friend from college? You might have heard of her. She's called Nyla Malik. Your friends with Nyla Malik? The model, Nyla Malik? Nyla Malik in the flesh. They told me not to book you. Is they everyone in the entire fashion industry? Pretty much. Yep, here I am. How come? I don't like Oscar Brierfeld. He's a creep and has an overly close relationship with his chinchilla. <laughs> <laughs> Just don't say that in a magazine interview. Might really mess things up for you. So might this. I'm not a big fan of people telling me what to do. <laughs> Nala said I could borrow her Lee Miller book. You, how are you? Oh, I'm fine, thanks. How are you? Still, let's small talk. Jetting on the glassy is a grand jetting on turn on, leading with the front leg on 
on simply changing direction. A jeté on turn on. Oh, why do that to yourself? It's complicated. Ballet, or the reason you're trying to learn it. Both. I'm mildly interested. Lexi was supposed to be going to the ballet this evening, but she can't because she's twisted her ankle. And her perfect existence is slightly less perfect. Heartbreaking news. There was nothing perfect about your mum dying when you were 11. Lexi's mum died? Lexi, bouncy, happy, owns more shoes than books, Lexi? Just because she doesn't go around acting sad all the time doesn't mean nothing's ever happened to her. That's fair. Well, her family, they're all in Dublin, and they'll visit the grave today, but Lexi's here. Her mum loved the ballet, so every year on her birthday, she goes. But uh, now she can't. So I'm trying to bring the ballet to her. I've got an afternoon to learn this, and it is not going well. Nope. 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 Not getting drawn in. But that video is not going to help. But I can. Yep, that's great, but could you give me a bit more... More attitude. How did you know? It's always more attitude. Oh, sorry, can you give me five? Sorry. Hey, I hope you don't mind us crashing. My little sister is kind of a fan. I don't mind. Hi, I'm Nyla. Nancy. But you can call me Nance. A lot of people call me Nance. No, they don't. Shut up, Sammy. Sammy? A lot of people call him Sammy. They do not. Isn't, do you mind if I leave Nancy here with you? I've got some... some things... that's important. Yeah, of course. <laughs> Wow, show me how you do that. That's the result of years of being tortured by my mother. But I can show you some moves. Come and stand behind me and copy. So, your mum made you do ballet? Yes, every Monday, Tuesday and Saturday. Until I was 12. That's when she officially gave up. Gave up what? Gave up trying to make me more like her. Just do the counter signature for me, then I can move on. No, I can't keep going over this. <sighs> don't. You just have to sign the papers. If I sign, and we risk losing you, our you, you just don't want to help me out. Can you give me one reason why she should. <laughs> Where did you get back? I was just talking to your mum about a small loan to help me get this new venture off the ground. Yeah, and what is this, Dad? Business number 11? 12? Tell me how the other ones work out for you. You're just a kid. You know, you don't understand anything. Well, I understand that you don't care about us. <laughs> you never come over here, and then when you do, it's because you want something. Dad, why don't you just do us all a favor and go? Mm Yeah, they're great. Yep, that's the last shots we need. Great. Um, can I ask a favour? I heard you 
studying fashion design. Did you make this? It shows. Is it worth walking away from modelling? Oh, I didn't walk away from modelling. Modelling walked away from me. OK. I've got a big campaign coming up, and I want you to be part of it. More than part of it, I want you to be the face of the campaign. Times are changing, Nyla. We're not all Oscar Bearfield. Think about it. Will you think about it? I mean, I kind of have to. It's money and security and general things my dad wants me to worry about. And... I have other people counting on me too. I don't know about that stuff, but I know what happy looks like. And when you were making me this dress, you looked happy. Right, come on, you. <laughs> Do we have to go home? It's getting late and Sam hasn't texted me back, so we probably should. You don't know me that well, but you've probably had a bag before. You probably know bags pretty well in general, so why don't you tell the bag was wrong? Because I'm not six. It's not an age thing. I'm always chatting to my bag. He's a good listener. He doesn't answer back. It's just, since Sammy moved to London, my dad, he's been coming around a lot more. Sam stands up for us, for me and Mum. He always has. Without Sam around, my dad's been a lot worse. Do you want a hug? Yeah. Don't worry, sis, he's gone. <sighs> and I thought I had it bad before. I call this a Sam Wellington. It's like a beef Wellington, except instead of beef, it has chicken. <laughs> when he was little, Sammy refused to eat cows. He liked them too much. Oh, he wouldn't go anywhere without his cuddly blue cow. That is not true. I was very cool, even as a young child. This is all just lies and slander. In that case, more lies and slander, please. <laughs> <laughs> he hated Halloween. I refuse to go trick-or-treating. Yeah, right. It's the night when all the ghosts come out. If they go out, I'm staying in. That's not scared. That's just smart. What? I love Halloween. It's my favourite holiday. Mm. I've actually started working on my outfit for the college party already. College party? So you're staying? It doesn't seem like the most logical choice, but... it definitely feels like the happy one. Mm. This is worrying. Me staying at college is worrying. No, what's worrying is if you're going to do something for Halloween, that means I have to do something for Halloween as well. <laughs> you never did for me. I saw your car at front. Hi. 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 I'm Nyla. It's Tori. She lives next door. They used to go out. Think you're ready? It has to be perfect. That would take years of training at ballet school. And it would be bland. It doesn't need to be perfect. It needs to be real. Yeah. Definitely not feeling jealous or intimidated in any way. <laughs> and in the red corner, we have Satori. She's known Sam her whole life. They dated for two years. She probably knows how Sam got that black eye. Also, the babies would look so cute. And in the blue corner, we have Nyla. She's known Sam a month. She really likes him, but what would she know? She's never even had a boyfriend. Seconds out, round one. Wait, wait. Aren't we better than this? Isn't there more to us than guys? Hey, um, do you mind staying? It's getting kind of late to drive back. You can stay in my room. That'd be awesome. When I have friends to stay, I'm allowed chocolate in bed. <laughs> that does sound pretty awesome. Sure. OK, well, I'm going to head. I'll walk you home. 
You haven't actually explained what you're doing here. Oh, fate played an evil trick on me. And, uh, me you wanted it like this. So... Your programme for this evening. because I'm happy. I mean, it was kind of terrible, but that's why it was perfect. I'm confused. My mum, she loved watching the ballet, but she couldn't do it, like, at all. She was always pirouetting in the kitchen and knocking things over. It was like watching her. You made me feel like she was here. <laughs> Okay, enough girling for one day. I'm out of here. Don't kiss her. Don't kiss her. Don't kiss her. Why don't you want him to kiss her? Because I want him to kiss you. Also, she cheated on him. Oh, they moved. That's super frustrating. The house feels nice, doesn't it? The air is lighter. Yeah, it needs to stay this way. There are local colleges. Not like the Athena. And you fought hard to win that scholarship. If I come here, then I can look after you and Nancy. What have you got there? Um, it's something I made. It's a, it's a present. I'll give Nancy hers later. I did it in class. You're not giving up on this. I won't let you. You're too talented. OK, for my group chat, serious face or stupid face? One of each. <laughs> Heads up. <laughs> so, did you kiss her? Whoa, that is not on the list of questions that a little sister can ask her big brother. But no, I didn't. I know I'm letting you down and I'm letting the agency down. Yeah, worst decision I've ever made. You've made that pretty clear, but... I can't go back to modelling just to make things right with you or make money for you or just to make you proud of me. I have to make me proud of me. And turns out that means designing the clothes and not wearing them. You ready? Mm. And then we did animal filters. So she was a cat and then I was a rabbit. Oh, and then we ate way too much chocolate. Oh, and then we did this quiz where you see what your anime character is and then we saw our faces as emojis. Oh, I'm so sorry. What? No, <laughs> I loved it. Plus, I really miss my sister and I really like Nancy. Yeah, I'm pretty lucky with the female side of my family. And you can't have everything, right? Was it really bad with your dad? 
It's been worse. Your black eye? No, no, no. Like he's he's got his faults, but that's not one of them. I sort of, I sort of hit myself. There was this dog that really wanted to lick my face, and I, I put my hand up, and I, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> you said the other guy started it. Yeah, the other guy did start. The other guy was a Labrador named Munchie. <laughs> <laughs> I will stop laughing. Just give me a second. <laughs> <laughs> oh, why, oh, why, oh, why, oh, can I trust myself? Trust myself. I wanna, wanna love you. I'm falling in love for the first time I know what everyone will say Pick me up, sign to the whole 